My name is Paul Bert Wendell Bonet. So many things have been said about uh, Dr. Laporte uh, today. What are some of your favorite memories of him? Roy Bryce Laporte was a sociologist, a pioneer in African American studies. He was an internationalist and someone who really spent much of his years mentoring younger students, as I was earlier, in the field of their, the field of African American studies. Okay, today we we talk to our children about STEM and globalization. Um, how would African American studies today help to inform um, all American students um, based on some of the contributions of yourself and Dr. Laporte? Well, first, it anchors us in our history. The history of blacks in the New World really did not begin with slavery. It occurred long before. The great African American kingdoms, Ghana, Songhai, um, Mali, as the case might be. What Bryce tried to do was to say whether your field is medicine or sociology or economics, there has to be a link with Africa, with a homeland. So he was one of the early transnationalists. And I feel that, again, whatever we do, if we have that anchor of Africa behind us, we'll be well served. How do we access his work um, today? Well, he was the first director of the Smithsonian Research Institute for Ethnic Studies. Much of his work is at the Smithsonian, um, at Yale, and at Colgate. And it's, it's, widely, it's widely accessed in mainly political science, sociology, and anthropology journals. If you were to we speak directly to young people that are scholars, whether they're um, elementary, middle school, high school, and there were, if there were nuggets of Dr. Laporte that you would advise them to go after, what would they be if they were trying to go online to find something? Well, or? the first place would be the Schomburg. Yeah. The Schomburg is an excellent source. It was actually started by a black Puerto Rican, and Roy Octay taught in Puerto Rico. The Schomburg would be an excellent source. He also worked with the Schomburg on the Professor Dotson, who's now at Harvard University. So that would be a, 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 a proximal source and a very profound one, the Schomburg. Well, thank you, sir. Is it possible to... Uh, contact you again. Uh, it, cer it certainly is. Yeah. I'd love to know anything for Roy Bryce Report. Who's and your mentor, name again? Aubrey Bonnet. And your email address? Bonnet, B-O-N-N-E-T-T-A at Old Westbury, one word, dot edu. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir.